The Bible describes prayer as pouring out the soul. 1 Samuel chapter 1, verse 15. And Hannah answered and said, No, my Lord, I am a woman of a sorrowful spirit. I have drunken neither wine nor strong drink, but have poured out my soul before the Lord. Saints, let us pour out our soul unto the Lord. Lord God, you are the omnipotent one, the all-powerful one. Lord God, you are the omniscient one, the one who knows all things, God. God, you are the Lord and creator of heaven and earth and everything that is therein. We come to you now, Lord, and we thank you, the saints, the sons of God, your children, presenting ourselves before you, God, lifting our hearts up to you. Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, I ask that you provide protection for those in Haiti, in Cuba, in the United States, in all areas that may potentially be affected by this coming storm, God, this hurricane. Lord, there are people who need to be saved there, God. There are people who can be saved, God, and you are not willing that any should perish, God. Lord, there are saints there, your children, God fellow brothers and sisters in Christ. There are children, God. There are, there are elderly. People need your help, God. Lord, I pray that just as many lives can be spared as possible, God, that, that, that no one is injured or killed. May they all find protection, God. I just ask that your hand will be upon them, Lord. Thank you, God. Thank you for being a God of mercy and a God, a God of love and a, a God of forgiveness, God. Thank you so much, Lord God. Thank you for our salvation, Lord. And I pray that if anyone is listening to this who isn't saved, God, that they will seek you and they will found you, Lord. That they will seek you while you can't be found in their lives, Lord God. Thank you, God. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. After this manner, therefore, pray ye, Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever. Amen.